After years of disappointing numbers, people are finally hopping on Cincinnati streetcars in record amounts. 2022 turned out to be the best year yet for people riding Cincinnati streetcars. Brad Underwood breaks down the numbers. It was a big year for the connector, breaking all kinds of records, but the biggest was the annual ridership number. The city of Cincinnati says that 846,622 passengers rode the streetcar in 2022. That crushes the record set back the first year of operation in 2017. The streetcar saw ridership records every month in 2022, except in June. There were just under 50,000 riders. That drop was due to a partial collapse of a building next to the station stop at 12th and Main, which suspended service between June 12th and July 1st. I haven't had a bad experience on the streetcar, and it's been quick, clean, and so, yeah, I've, I've enjoyed my time. Alex Tolman says he primarily rides on the weekends. Today, he's getting from OTR to the banks. We came from uh, Findlay Market. It took about 10, 15 minutes. It was a nice ride, a little crowded, but I mean, there's seats, and you could, you could find whatever you needed, so I enjoyed it. The director of the streetcar calls the new record a gratifying accomplishment in a statement released by the city. Big events this year also helping to boost those numbers, including Blink, Taste of Cincinnati, and Oktoberfest. Blink took place in October. More than 103,000 people rode the streetcar during the month, crushing the previous record by 20,000. But maybe the biggest reason ridership is at an all-time high, it's still free to ride it. Along the streetcar tracks, Brad Underwood, Local 12 News. And the city of Cincinnati took over day-to-day -day operations of the streetcar from Sorda in 2022, or 2020. The Ludlow 